thank you for joining us. This week we're going to be talking about the parable of the sower in uh, Matthew, Matthew chapter 13. Today we're going to be talking about verses 1 through 9, and then the rest of the week we're going to be moving on from verses 18 through 23. 18 to 23 for the rest of the week. But today we're going to talk about the parable of the sower. And I'm going to use the Good News Bible this week because it kind of explains it a little better. Uh, so the Good News Bible for chapter 13 of Matthew says this, that, uh, starting at verse, the second part of verse 3. It says, Once there was a man who went out to sow corn. As he scattered the seed in the field, some of it fell along the path. And the birds came and ate it up. Some of it fell on rocky ground where there was little soil. The seed soon sprouted because the soil wasn't deep. But when the sun came up, it burnt the young plants. And because the roots had not grown deep enough, the plants soon dried up. Some of the seed fell among thorn bushes, which grew up and choked the plants. But some of the seed fell in good soil. And the plants produce corn, and some produce a hundred grains, others sixty, and others thirty. And Jesus concluded, listen then, if you have ears. This week we're going to be talking about the seed that God has given to us. I and mean, I want to be very clear from the beginning. Sometimes we hear people talk about seed, and they're only going to be talking about money. But no, this week we're not talking about money. We're talking about the seed of God's word. The seed of God's word, and that, that seed has been placed in our heart. I want us to look this week at guarding that seed, making sure that we are the good soil so that we can see where God is going to take us, see what God is going to do in us, and how his word can sprout up and bear fruit in our lives for not just this generation, but for generations to come, because this is what God has called us to do. This is what he's asked us to do. He's sowing the seed of his word in our lives just so that we can sprout up and grow and bear fruit. So stay tuned. Tomorrow we're going to talk about what happens with our seed and how we need to guard it from various things. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next week. No, tomorrow. <laughs>